President Biden has warned the United States is facing a pandemic of the unvaccinated as the Delta variant of coronavirus spreads rapidly in areas where the uptake of jabs has been low. Speaking in Virginia, Mr. Biden praised the governor of Alabama, Kay Ivey, who said it was time to start blaming the unvaccinated for the rise in infections. Here's our North America correspondent, David Willis. With less than 34 percent of its population fully vaccinated, Alabama is the least vaccinated state in this country. And Thursday's remarks by its Republican governor were well received by the White House. Folks supposed to have common sense. But it's time for to start blaming the unvaccinated folks, not the regular folks. It's the unvaccinated folks that are letting us die. In a speech, President Biden echoed Governor Kay Ivey's assertion that the recent rise in COVID-19 cases was the fault of those who've refused to get vaccinated. What we have now is a pandemic of the unvaccinated. There's the point. Virtually all the COVID-19 deaths and hospitalizations are today among the unvaccinated people. And I know, I know this has gotten a bit politicized, but I hope it's starting to change. A growing number of Republicans and conservative leaders have called on people to get vaccinated in recent days, following a nearly threefold increase in coronavirus cases in the last two weeks, most of them involving people who have not been vaccinated. 56% of Americans, including children, have now received at least one jab. But a new poll suggests that the majority of those who've yet to be vaccinated still say they are unlikely to do so.